beans are usually easy to grow and harvest and today isn't any different. We're talking about the butter bean, also known as the wax bean, a bean variety with a soft bean taste. Let's get growing. Hey and what is going on everybody? Welcome to The Fawn Dream. My name is Raymond and today we're looking into the butter bean. We're gonna start with the germination process and that requires quite a lot of heat. We like to germinate them inside and we start the growing process about one month before the last frost date. Create a mini greenhouse by grabbing a decent sized pot and adding seed starter or compost. Poke a few holes and put one seed in for every hole. Add a splash of water, but don't give them too much. A bit of cling film on top to keep the moisture inside. We leave this at room temperature or in a greenhouse. Don't put it above any active heating because that might be too hot. In about five days they will rise to the top. When you see them poking through, it is time to take off the cling film and introduce them to some light. Make sure it stays moist but not completely wet. And also make sure you don't put it above any active heating. Now it's time to take them outside. They like a sunny spot. Be sure there will be no more frost because they won't be able to handle it. Mix in some compost into the soil because they do like to stick the roots in some nutrients. Take the seedlings out with a spoon and put them in a the soil about 10 to 15 centimeters or 4 to 6 inches apart. You can put a transparent cap on top to protect them from birds and snails. And also this will help the growth because it is like a mini greenhouse. Now you can also directly sow them outside about one week before the last frost date. Poke a hole every 10 to 15 centimeters or 4 to 6 inches and put in the seeds about 2.5 centimeters or 1 inch deep. Give the seeds a good water, but don't overdo it. It will take about 5 to 7 days for the beans to stick their head out. Do remember that they like to germinate in heat, so if you don't have too much heat, add a tarp on top or put them underneath some glass. Since this is a small bush variety, we don't really need a trellis or support. But if you're planting something else that looks similar but just grows a little bit bigger, make sure to support it. After about eight to nine weeks, we can start harvesting. We're looking for a bean that is about 13 to 15 centimeters or about five inch. Snap it off at the top and get ready to dig in. As with many beans, the butter bean likes to be harvested regularly. This is to make sure that it can put its energy at another bean and make sure that everything grows fully. If you want a continuous harvest throughout the summer, you need to sow them about three weeks apart. Now these beans do tend to attract quite a lot of aphids, so it's good to have flowers nearby that attract ladybugs and hoverflies. And there you have it, all you need to know to start growing your own butter beans. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments and I'll be sure to answer them. If you like this video, hit that like button and uh, if you want to see some more, check out these other videos and don't forget to live the farm dream.